What's up YouTube, this is Square2448 with a Farming Simulator 2015 mod review and today we'll be doing two John Deere's, one's a pack and one's not. So the pack, it's these two John Deere's and then we have this amazing track John Deere. So we'll jump in and I'll show you guys everything that it has. So it spawns you right in the in cab view which that's really nice and actually I don't know why but uh, I didn't have my game volume so, so I had to redo it and I already opened all the features but uh, I'll show you how to close close them so you press right control and you close that you could put this bench seat up and down uh, the steering wheel goes up and down and it goes in turn the lights on so that's pretty cool you come over here you could turn the screen on and off you could turn lights on beacons on hazards on come back here and you can shut and open the window so it's a pretty cool tractor and I've been waiting for this to come out for a while and the startup is actually really nice so and one other thing is the cab moves separately so it's actually pretty weird seeing the um like the uh, cat like the engine move and that doesn't so we're gonna test its max speed here but it does have hazards and working lights so it's a pretty amazing tractor in my opinion and I'm gonna be using this on the farm so you guys will be able to see this on the new map once I choose that but when you t turn a 180 there's this weird background just in your way and I don't know what it is and that's one of the downfalls to this if you guys can see it on the front windshield and it's not on any of the others and it moves every time so now it's on this one just so you can't see it so I don't really know what it is but um I hope it doesn't bother us like how it is now but we'll go check this in the store now so it's the John Deere 9560RT and it's $379,599 it's $295 a day and the max horsepower is 350 so it is a really strong tractor so that's it for the tract one and now this is the pack and the only difference is that this has a three point in the front and this one doesn't so we'll just do one on this and we won't even start it up yet so warning lights it brings out these lights there we can put extra weights on it on the wheel wells in between them uh, we could put on the double wheels really really nice feature it's good for farming and then it's good for transporting this way and you can have a work light and work lights on the front and back for working at, at the late hours and when we get inside trying to see you can open that which opens a hood and that's really really nice feature you could pretend and take pictures of working on your tractor and then you just reclose it wait I don't know why it's not closing. Oh, it was that one. Wow. So, the other one that I was clicking was for the hydraulics in the front. So, you see that it's down. Well, you could go in here and you can close it. So, that's also a nice feature. And same with the other one. And this one, you can open the door. And open the window so it's a really nice tractor and the interior is pretty nice it could be a little bit more detailed up in the corner 
And the one thing I don't see is AC. So, to all the people who really do like AC, that's the downfall. But, um, it's a really, really nice tractor when you put everything on. It looks good. And it has an American license plate of North Dakota. Has the blinkers, but you could barely see them. Has working mirrors, which that's an amazing feature. And its max speed is 30 miles an hour, so it's a pretty fast tractor, I would say. So, if you guys want to see more of these mod reviews, you can check back later this week since I will have a couple more mod reviews up later this week and the other tractor is the same as this so there's no need to do a review on that just that um, when you add extra weights it just adds it to the front that's the only difference is weight in the front instead of a three point so that's the difference between that and when you go to the store there are 200 222,700 and there are $295 a day and it's 350 horsepower so it's still the same and they have the same everything same price and it's the John Deere 8 530FH and the John Deere 8530 and I'm sorry for the pause there I don't really know why that was there but I hope you guys enjoyed I will have the links in the description and if you guys want to see more check back later this week and always remember to subscribe and with that like always like comment and subscribe